We're trying to replicate the sun locally. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it would be dope. Fission is very easy. We have fission reactors. Yes. All of the nuclear power that we think about is yes. from fission, which is the splitting of atoms. Yes. Those are like relatively easy to control. Okay. Okay. Because you've got these rods of uranium yes. that are spitting out neutrons. Yes. And then in between, you can have rods of graphite yes. that slow down the neutrons. Yes. Right. And so you can have this sort of static nuclear reactor that is creating heat, creating energy that causes uh, steam from water. Yes. And then that steam turns a turbine. Right. Right. right, right, right the right. heat creates motion, which turns a turbine. Yes. With fusion, isolating fusion, right? Fusion is happening in plasma. It's not happening in solid materials. Mm. In order to create energy from fusion, you need this plasma, which is super hard to control. Mm -hmm. It's super hard to contain. Mm -hmm. And then, and then uh, once we have that, we need, we need to have it self-sustaining and then create a heat source that then powers the turbine. It's, it's a whole thing, right? And if we don't understand the mathematics fundamentally, then th there's no hope. The holy grail would be fusion, mm -hmm. right? Fusion power, because then we could just use hydrogen right. instead of trying to find like uranium and all this other yes. crazy rare earth stuff. Hydrogen yes. is just in water. It's we everywhere. just find hydrogen. We could purify deuterium, which is an isotope of hydrogen. We'd combine them together and basically replicate the sun you know, this is the dream. Yeah, right. We replicate right. the sun in a building and that just feeds us electricity.